Welcome to Informatica support videos. My name is Vikas and I am here to talk about how to create a config in IDR. The agenda is to understand the type of modes to run a config, creating a config and the types of apply modes to target. To run the data replication tasks, we need to create a config. Before creating a config, we need to select a mode. We do have two type of modes local mode and network mode local mode is used to run the replication locally on one machine network mode is used to run the replication across a network using the server manager I'm selecting network mode and try to connect an error message is displayed stating the server manager is not responding Run the server manager which is located in the IDR home directory. Server manager started successfully. Now try reconnecting it. Connected successfully. I'll be showing an example to create a config. Click new. In the new dialog box enter a configuration file name and select the source and target server and environment variables list if needed define the source database and connect define the target database and connect enter the schema for source and target select the source table and the target table for mapping here data replication provides three types of apply modes SQL apply, audit apply and merge apply SQL apply executes SQL statements on the target that are equivalent to the SQL change operations on the source. Audit apply is used to audit SQL changes made to a source by using an audit log table in the target database. Merge apply is a combination of SQL apply and audit apply. Now I'll select SQL apply. We can customize column mappings. When we map tables, data replication maps source columns to target columns that have matching names by default. On the map columns tab, we can manually map or unmap columns. Also, we can set some capture options for the selected pair of map tables. Save the config. Yes to the recovery target table. We can see the newly created config under the configs tab. With this, we come to the end of this video. We would love to hear back from you. You can reach us on support videos at the rate infomedica.com or twitter.com slash infosupport. Thank you.